Thanks, Dan. We continue our coverage of local debates with a focus on Wisconsin's 94th District Assembly seat. Now, that covers part of La Crosse County, including Onalaska, West Salem, Holman, and Mindoro. Democratic Representative Steve Doyle from Onalaska has held the seat for the past nine years. However, it's a seat that state Republicans are targeting because they believe they can flip it with their candidate, Kevin Hoyer. He's a farmer from the town of Hamilton. But these aren't the only two in the race. As you can see, independent Leroy Brown, the second, is also running. Now, roads were a hot topic for this district in the 2018 election. So News 19 asked these candidates if they believe the roads are better in 2020. All three discussed a line item veto by the governor in July to reduce the budget for local roads and bridges from 90 million to 75 million and open it up as a grant opportunity for communities to submit their projects. Years ago, it was all the legislature's fault for not giving us money. And now when the legislature gives us money, our governor takes it away and our representative backs the governor on this. We need to have someone that looks out for the 94th district and make sure that the money comes back to the 94th district to go to what it's needed for. Um, I don't agree with the governor's decision to send the money to mass transit. Um, and I have been working with the Wisconsin Counties Association and others, uh, also the Towns Association as an attorney for one of our towns here in, in La Crosse County to try to rectify that problem. Long way to go, a lot of miles still need to be fixed. Um, I definitely uh, would look at seeing how we can shore that up um, speaking to the line item veto, I'm not, I'm not always a fan of the way that's used at the governor's level. I feel that uh, that it should be really about canceling out a provision, not changing the meaning of a provision. Now you can watch the full debate on our website, wxow.com.